Hey y'all, welcome back to The Baby Life. Today, me and the girls are about to head out to do a little bit of last minute Christmas shopping. Hi hey girls. Um, last minute shopping, I just have to get stocking stuffers and um, we'll get some lunch. We really just need to get out the house because we have been in this house for three days straight, like just in here chilling. It's been cloudy and really gloomy here in arizona so we literally decides to just stay in <laughs> and i've been like deep cleaning and organizing and stuff like that so i was like let's go out and get some air today so yeah that's what we are doing today carson's begging for a snack but we really should just go and get lunch at this point and kaylee is happy and in a good mood say hi hi you want to talk no okay and here is Tootie. Say hi. I can't. I can't do peace because <laughs> she has her snack. These are my Sam. favorite crafty. These are my favorite crackers. And this is my little sunny bee. <laughs> so yeah, we're about to go out for a little bit and get some fresh air and get some shopping done. So we will take you along with us. Say bye. <laughs> See you later. Uh, yeah. Alright y'all, so we literally have not even made it to a store yet. <laughs> we left the house and I went to the car wash to clean my car. So I deep cleaned my car, vacuumed it out and everything. And by that time, Kaylee has fell asleep. Carson is now looking like she's sleepy. Both of us are ready to eat. So... <laughs> We are just gonna go and get um, some food now and then head back to the house to eat and let them take a nap. And while they're napping, I will be um, doing some other stuff I have to do, like folding towels and that kind of thing. And then once they get up, we'll come back out and we'll go to um, a couple stores. I need to go into Home Goods to look around for a few things that I don't need, but I kind of want. Um, we're taking the girls on a little Christmas adventure next week. And I kind of want them to have a couple more Christmassy outfits to wear just so they don't have the same thing on in every single picture. So I'll go get them um, a couple more things and maybe a set of Christmas pajamas, extra Christmas pajamas um, that they'll wear while we're there. Because I will vlog the entire trip and take some pictures of them and um i kind of want to find some cute spatulas and like um you know the baking set to take pictures with because Brittany is coming to do our family christmas photos at the house on saturday so i have to get photos i mean i have to get utensils and everything lined up for that um and then the lady that usually does all of their photos their newborn photos i booked i think i told y'all this in like um the welcome back chit chat meeting kaylee i booked our christmas photos way back in july right and they are non-refundable like it's a mini session but i just knew like the setup was perfect i just knew i wanted her to do the christmas photos so i went ahead and booked them literally paid 275 for a mini session which is only like 20 minutes super expensive but pictures are phenomenal every time she does them so first christmas for kaylee and us having both of the girls i wanted a really cute session booked it and then lo and behold we are out of town when our session rolled around um she was nice enough to let me gift it to a friend so um i gave it to one of my girlfriends and her family went and took the pictures in our place so it doesn't feel like a complete loss to me which is better than you know just 275 down the drain at least a friend was able to use it and i know her pictures are going to be amazing so luckily i um had already reached out to britney to do another session for us so i still have christmas photos it just won't be that backdrop they'll now be done in our home which will still be cute britney does amazing work i'm just having to like run around and find the staging now myself <laughs> and think about the setup and how how the pictures are going to come out but either way they're gonna they're gonna look really good so yeah that's that's the plan that's what's going on and my baby is asleep Ugh. 
So yeah, I'm gonna ride um, to get some food. She'll probably wake up and eat when we get home, and then she'll go down for another little nap. So yeah, go. All right, y'all. So we're back at home. We have what are you eating, Carson? Um, raisin canes. Raisin canes. And where's my bread? We've been in South Carolina for a couple, well, three over three weeks now, and they do not have a canes there. So we were excited to get some canes when we got back home. And Miss Kaylee, her bottle is warming up. Okay, it's coming. It's coming. Hi, Judy. <laughs> Hi. What are these? What are these, Mommy? Stuff to make gingerbread houses. Come on. Okay. I'm coming. Hi, Kika. Hi. Hi, Kika, Kika, Kika. They look at the all right, y'all, so we just finished in Home Goods. Kaylee is hungry, so I'm warming up her breast milk and the bottle warmer. As you can hear, she's fussing. I absolutely love this car. So I drive a Hyundai Palisade, and it's literally the best thing ever because I have outlets in here. So I can, like, plug up her bottle warmer and warm her milk. It's just, like, the perfect mom car. If you are on the market for an SUV or a mom type of car, I highly recommend the Hyundai Palisade. It is amazing. 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 We named our sassy. Well, Carson named the car sassy. And we love our sassy. So, um, yeah. Home Goods has some really nice stuff in there. Especially, like, gift sets. Proud of myself that I went to my favorite store and did not spend all kinds of unnecessary money. I literally just got what I went in there for, which was, like, some Christmassy baking utensils that'll look good in our pictures um saturday morning so i grabbed those didn't break the bank getting them and now i'm just gonna feed her before i go in target so let me show y'all what it looks like so this is her little bottle warmer warms her breast milk i could i could nurse her but i really just don't feel like it and i brought milk with me so i'm just gonna heat it up and it's literally plugged into an outlet right here which is so convenient like, I just love this car. Love it, love it, love it. So, yeah, anyways, I'll show you what I find in Target. I'm going to go and get the stocking stuffers. And, yeah, she just be stocking stuffers unless I see some. Oh, yeah, I'm going to look for um, some Christmassy outfits in their kids' department because TJ Maxx didn't have any. Our TJ Maxx and Home Goods, my favorite one is Connected. It's like one big store, both stores combined, however you want to see it. But they didn't have anything in there, so I'm going to look in Target to try and find something because the weather in Flagstaff, Arizona next week is going to be insane. Like a low of 3 degrees and a high of 32. So it's going to be super cold. So I got to get them a couple um, couple warmer pieces that are Christmassy. I'm going to try to find a snowsuit, actually. That way I can make sure they're good and warm while we're out because the majority of our activities will be at nighttime. <laughs> so we can see the christmas lights and everything so yeah i'm gonna search for that and then head home before it gets too too late so yeah stay tuned hey y'all welcome back as you see we're in this jungle car this mommy's car and you hear that kayla is crying her bottle is actually warming up and we are in this car and we're about to go to tj maxx no we're leaving tj maxx we're going to target oh we're going to target and tj maxx doesn't have nothing nothing i mean nothing so so mama's gonna get kaylee feeder and this all kinds of stuff and i really love this section i got my nails done and we we are so i want to tell you something that that's um been on my mind okay so i got an elf okay okay 
she wrote on my face last night and she took a picture of us and I had to clean my face off and then she wiped some marshmallows now come on uh so the 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 four of our stockings they're gonna be filled up with candy <laughs> and and it's a simple it's a simple matter of fact that it's getting dark and there's all colors and and this world up in the sky. Do you like my hair? I know it's so messy, but my grandma thinks she has slick stuff. Got slick stuff to slick my hair, and now it's all messy. Look at these tangles. Look at them. You see them? We gotta take it down tonight too, cause we got pictures Saturday. So tomorrow Saturday. Tomorrow's Friday. We can do your hair tomorrow if you want to. Okay. Okay. It's okay. So um, we are this inside this world, and we are inside this world. We are inside this world. We just left. We left um, Gammy's house, and I am so sad. So sad. You and mommy is taking us to the Polar Express, and it's gonna be so cold. Yes, it is. So cold. And as you can see, Kaylee is stop crying. Her milk is still warm. You see that? See the milk? <laughs> I'm about to change her pamper. She about to change her pamper. And Kaylee is still crying because um her milk is still warm. And she tells us the death to warm our milk up and it makes her start to fuss. So she just got to have it cold. So, she, so we, That's the problem. She won't drink it if it's not the perfect temperature. So it, That's we, right. But she, but she still keeps crying. And I do her. not know why she keeps doing that. Okay? You hear me? You hear me? And... And if you see Rosie, if you see Rosie on the top of me. Rosie, you're ill. Uh-huh. If you see Rosie on the top of me, yeah, yo. If I see your little legs come down from back here, this yeah. Yeah, Yell and she's up there, okay? Yell. Anywhere she is, and I'll kick her out. You love Rosie. She's a wild, crazy elf. Mm hmm. That was what I was about to say, but stay tuned. All right, y'all. Somebody ate all of her vegetables at dinner, so she is having her chocolate. Hot, hot chocolate for dessert. What are you doing? Yes, oh, I'm not looking for marshmallow. <laughs> All right, y'all. So this is what I picked up at Home Goods. I found this cute little Jingle Bells cookie jar. Um, that'll look really cute. We're gonna do um some Christmassy baking situation photos right here on the counter i'll probably put like two christmas trees like one mini christmas tree here one mini christmas tree here on this end of the island and then we'll be in the middle and we'll take pictures here all that that's on the counters will disappear in the kitchen will look all nice and clean um either on the counter or on the bar stools right behind so that the trees are you know in the frame so yeah this will be on the island for a prop and then I also found this little cute um, baking set. It's like the bowl, spoon, a cookie cutter, and the rolling pin. 
which is super cute. The girls can like play with it while we're baking and I'll probably put like some brownie mix or something inside of the bowl and they can like eat it for the pictures and get kind of messy. It'll be cute. And then I just found this really cute red and white striped towel that'll just kind of be tossed on the counter. I may put out some flour and some cookie dough, have some things baked and it'll look really pretty in the frame. And then we are going to put together some gingerbread houses and those will also be on the counter for display. Delicious. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. So yummy. She loves this time of year because she gets to drink hot cocoa uncontrollably. Well, you kind of drink it all the time anyways at Starbucks. So I got tired of buying her Starbucks every time we went out. <laughs> and TJ Maxx and Home Goods is my favorite store. And I found these hot cocoa Starbucks cans there. And they were only $7.99, which is a lot cheaper than how many times I was buying her Well, Well, did you know... That we're going on the Polar Express and at Mommy's work, they have snow there. So mm -hmm. we're going there and it's going to be extra cold. So we got to wear... You're going to Flagstaff to the North Pole Experience. And then you're also going to um, the Polar Express, which is in another neighboring town. Can I have one? No more, that's all. So yeah, um, and then I finally got the house pretty much done for Christmas. I have a couple new Christmas trees. So I have a pencil tree, let me show you. I have a pencil tree that's right here. And that's Norman, our topper that we've had for years. He's there. And then I decorated our um, little table here. Most of the decorations came from Hobby Lobby, Home Goods, and at home. That's where everything came from. So yeah, that's what that setup looks like. And then um, the little Mary Grinchmas sign came from Hobby Lobby. We have more decor over here. This is the Grinch corner. So got the whole Grinch theme going over here because Carson honestly loves the Grinch more than she loves Santa. So we have that and then I just have some throw pillows on the sectional and blankets that all came from home goods actually just hung drapes last night and have our photos on the wall that's just normal stuff that doesn't change but the accents are red that came from home goods and then up here we have the main christmas tree which is we call it um the big home alone tree um they really wanted a big one in that space, so we have that one, a nutcracker. And then up here we have two smaller trees and the cute little North Pole Express post. Carson will be able to put her um, letter in there once we get a letter written. It looks when you come in and have two smaller trees. So these are the two trees that I'm probably going to move from right here and put them on the island when Brittany comes to take our pictures just for some extra aesthetic and then I have um, garland up here in the foyer when you come in the big Christmas tree <clears throat> a little mailbox we found this little truck in Santa situation at Cracker Barrel we even have <laughs> the little wallflowers from Bath and Body Works that are super super cute Christmas themed the table set up and there is Rosie, our elf who is always up to mischief. The nutcracker is from at home. And then there's garland that goes along the staircase. And then you just have the pencil tree there. And then the kids area over there, the Grinch. So yeah, that's how the setup looks right now. I really like it. I think I'm gonna go um, at the end of the season and buy a couple more Christmas trees because I kind of want to decorate upstairs next year. Like I want a tree in our bedroom and one in the loft. So I will um, pick up a couple extra trees when they're like cheaper at the end of the season and some more decorations to put up for next year. <laughs> Alright, 
Kegel is in the bed. We're snuggled on the couch. Carson's in her heated blanket from Gammy. Yep. And we're watching the troll. Yeah, we're watching this movie Troll on Netflix. Y'all let us know if y'all liked it. This is our second attempt at what she's watched it already with her grandparents. We're trying to watch it because we started it when we was in South Carolina and then we fell asleep because we was exhausted. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so now we're trying to watch it again. So yeah. We're gonna sit here and snuggle and chill out until it's time for Miss Ma'am to go to bed. No. <laughs> All right, y'all, we're gonna end the vlog right here. Hope you enjoyed our day. We're sitting here eating fries and chicken nuggets like the big kids that we are mm -hmm. because our actual kids are in the bed. Amen. <laughs> mm. Don't it taste free. Mm. Yeah. It just Peace. tastes like free. Mm. No love at all. So yeah, we're just about to sit here and eat and finish watching this movie and figure out where we're putting the elf for Carson in the morning and call him at night. So we will see y'all in the next vlog.